Number 64, a heart pacemaker fires 72 times a minute, each time a 25 nanofarad capacitor is charged by a battery in series with a resistor to point uh, 632 of its full voltage. What is the value of the resistance? So first of all, this is just noise. Focus on what's given in the problem, all right? Uh, we're given a, basically, uh, firings per time, right? Or discharges or charges per time. Um, in order for the pacemaker to go off 72 times a minute, what's the period in between beats? In other words, if it goes off 72 times per one minute, if we flip this, then that tells us the time per beat, right? 72, and instead of times here, you know, let me use the word beats, okay? Because I think that... 72 times is fine, but minutes per time, it beats a little better. So when we do this division, right, this simply tells us now that 1 over 72, it's going to be 0 0.0139 or so minutes per beat, right? Now, you know we don't want minutes, right? We got to have seconds probably. So minutes on the bottom, seconds on the top, 60 seconds in a minute. Just simply take that and multiply it by 60. And now we're real. Now we realize that it's 0.833 seconds uh, per beat. Now that should make sense, right? If the pacemaker were to go off once a second, then you'd have 72. Uh, excuse me, 60 times a minute it would go off. But if it fires a little less than uh, one second, uh, its period that is, then it should be more than 60 times a minute, and it'll be 72. Anyway. So what this represents now, the significance of this, is this is like the period between firings, right? That is known as tau, the time constant. So we know tau, we're finding the resistance, and we know the capacitance, just simply use this formula, right? So this is going to be 0.833 is equal to R times the capacitance is 25 nanofarads, but you know we need that in farads, so just simply take that, multiply by 10 to the ninth, divide now this value on a cross from both sides, and it's going to be 0 0.833333 divided by 25 times 10 to the minus 9th. And that works out to be now 3333333. Right, as you can see, 3.3333, as you can see, it's 3333. So I'm a little loopy, sorry. What time is it now? Uh, yeah, 1, yeah, 1.16 a.m. All right, so here we go. So this is then uh, 1.33. Times in, oh my god, I'm gonna go cross side one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, seven. And not x to the seventh, oh boy, I think that's it. Uh, and that's in ohms, all right? So about 33 uh, mega ohms. There you go. All right, guys, hopefully that helped. I'm probably done for tonight or this morning, however you wanna look at it. Take care.